Just imagine a scenario that you have completed a research article as a leading author. Then you just send that article to one of your friend for proofreading. And few days later, you just received it back with so many changes. But now you are confused what exactly is added, what exactly is deleted and what exactly is modified. What if there is a way to track every single change in your document? Then obviously you will be happy. This is basically the function of track changes in Microsoft Word. And this is exactly what I'm going to discuss in today's video. To activate track changes in a specific document, simply go to review tab in the ribbon and from here simply select track changes so once you will select the track changes it will turn into gray you can deactivate track changes by clicking it anytime on track changes you can see this small arrow by clicking this arrow you can have three these three options if you just want to activate just only for you then you can select this just mine but if you want to activate track changes for everyone who will have this document then you can select this for everyone and here is also another option of locking lock tracking for example if you do not want to give this option to any of your friend that they can unselect this track changes then this is a good option that you can just lock tracking to this document for example i will click this lock tracking now i just put a password again re-enter the password but make sure that you must remember this password if you lock tracking then other people will not deactivate the track changes if you want to unlock again you can simply click it and here you need to enter the password since track changes has been activated to this document let make few changes let's just delete this one let rewrite these three lines change it into italic and then control s to save all these changes suppose i have received this document from my friend with the following changes how will i know that what changes are being made by my friend so simply I will go again from the review tab and from here I can see along with these track changes here it is selected as no markup. What can I do? I will simply change it from no markup to simple markup. So once I will click simple markup so it will highlight all those lines where the changes have been made. For instance you can see the changes are being made in this line and then these three lines and and on this line as well. So this will only tell you the, the lines with the changes. But if I want to see the more details I will need to change it from simple markup to all markup. Now you can see it has provided me the details that what our changes are being made by my friend. You can see this word is deleted and here you can see the earlier lines are replaced with the new ones and here you can see the words have been changed into italic and here it is uh, given with the details font italic. So this is how you can uh, trace out all the changes in a document. If I am okay with all these changes then I can simply select from here this accept option and from here I can simply select accept all these changes but if I accept few changes and reject others then I can just simply select one by one for example just select this one from here I can simply select this select accept this change and for example if I am uh, rejecting this change I can select this one and then from here I can just simply select this reject change and this is also a good option if we want to move on to next change simply select this next so it will take us to next change and now we can select whether to accept or reject this change. And if we are interested to see the original version of our document, we can go from here all markups. We can simply select original. See now what is showing us the original document. So this is how you can use the track changes in Microsoft Word.